Greetings and salutations everyone out there in internet land. I'm Harold Britt and I'd like to welcome you all to another awesome vlogumentary. Uh, this past weekend was free comic book day as of the recording of this video. We got to be vendors at the free comic book day throwdown right outside the Crime Alley Comics and Collectibles, my good friends there in Lumberton, North Carolina. Uh, stop in, see Sean, check him out. He's got Funko Pops, comic books, um, the DC Multiverse figure line. Check him out. I mean, he's got some other stuff too, but yeah, uh, pay him a visit. Um, <clears throat> We had, uh, they had Wrestling with a Purpose, given on a free show, R real good promotion run by uh, Baron Bullard. Uh, there were, they had free food. Oh man, let's just get to the video, because um, yeah, th there was even a Deadpool impersonator there, uh, Mr. Clarence Adams, real good dude, uh, but uh, let's get to the video. <laughs> So here is the sign and advertisement for the free comic book day throwdown. And uh, as you can see, August 14th, uh, here's a little peek at our table. Had some of the stuff uh, on our tote as well. Got a lot of stuff there. Uh, just us and the wrestlers and uh, Mr. Clarence, our Deadpool, he was there with uh, Sean. Uh, we hadn't not all the vendors had got there yet and so uh here is uh, my interview with sean hope you guys enjoy it all right guys so um here i am in crime alley comics and collectibles with my good friend sean thornton hey guys how we doing where's the camera there it is <laughs> there it is <laughs> so uh sean why don't you uh, tell us about your store and everything sure here uh crime alley comics and collectibles we've been here about a year and a half uh opened up two days before the covid shut down in 2020 shut down for two months decided i was gonna open back up you know because lumberton needed a place where they could come buy comic books funko pops action figures i mean you name it um I got Deadpool distracting me dancing to the right over here because <laughs> we're here for free comic book day. It's August 14th uh, from 3 to 9 today. We're going to be out here doing the, the free comic books, free professional wrestling, from wrestling with purpose. And Baron Bullard and his guys are, you know, top notch. And uh, yeah, man, so we're just here doing the thing, bring some kids out to the community, have a good time. We've got some uh, Deadpool over here is going to be taking pictures with the kids. And uh, yeah. And on top of that, this is free comic book day. It so, is free comic book day. Yes, it is. So, uh, if you want to come over here, man, you can actually show the books on the table. Oh, yes. Uh, Mr. Cole. Yeah. So here's, yes, here we go. Some of the books we got for free comic book day. There's uh, Near the House of Slaughter, Stray Dogs, Spider-Man, Venom, Avengers, Batman, King Shark. I mean, just a lot of cool titles. Um, come on down. We're here at uh, 2402 East Elizabethtown Road in Lumberton, North oh. Carolina. This is like after the fact. Oh, I got you. Oh, got you. Yeah. No worries. No worries. But uh, well, they can come see us. They ain't gotta come just because. That's free right. They, day. they can come anytime. <laughs> yeah, we're normally open from three to seven Monday through Friday and twelve to five on Saturdays. We're also on um, Instagram and Facebook. Crime Alley Comics and Collectibles. Give us a like. Give us a follow. Give us a share. We'll make. Uh, as soon as we get new stuff, we put it up on there right away so you can see what we're getting. Well, you know, so you ain't gotta waste a trip coming down here and we don't have your favorite thing and we want. But, uh, yeah, that's yeah. what we got going on today. Yeah, I think I'll get me a couple free comic books yeah, from you while, we, uh, one, one while we're here. Let's see. Got some Batman. That's an awesome story. That leads into Fear State. They're finally doing a really good uh, Scarecrow story with Batman. Where he's oh, the main villain, and he is a villain. He's, like, oh, scary, sweet. scary. Not, like, goofy like a Scarecrow, like on like Batman on, on animated Arkham. series on Arkham. Yeah, he is yeah. scary in this one. Awesome. You know, Scarecrow is my favorite villain after all, guys. I mean, <laughs> but, let's see. He's on Titans this year, too. Then. Oh, he's on it's Titans? Titans series, Jonathan. Yep. Oh, snap. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Are you, are you a video game guy? You like Assassin's Creed? I got those. I got Star Wars. Uh, those are both two Star Wars. I got Street yeah. Fighter. 
never that, been. That is a really cool story. That's one of the biggest comic books to come out in a long time. Straight up, it's oh, man. basically like all dogs go to he- all dogs go to heaven meets like Science of the Lambs. Oh, huh. yeah, it's really good. Yeah, I think I'll get a copy of that. Yeah. And House of Slaughter is going to be good too because that's yeah. spinning off of uh, something that's killing the children. Which is the biggest comic book to probably come out in 10 years. And then I'll give me some Zorro. I do I like a little Spider-Man. bit of. I got Spider Man Venom. I got some Valiant stuff with Ninjax. It's got Harbinger. Uh, White Ash. Got some old school Archie. Can't go wrong with Archie. Oh, yeah. A little bit of Archie. I got Vampirella. I got um, Beast Boy and Raven. King Shark from Suicide Squad, which just happens to be playing right now on TV. Oh, yeah. So, yeah and there's some behind you, too. Uh, mm-hmm. On the bottom shelf here, you can do uh, those are all kid books. Mm hmm. Uh, like Sonic the Hedgehog and Batman and Robin stuff like that, and over here's the mature ones, you know, for the, the adult readers. Yeah, <laughs> the like, older guys yeah, like us. Like the, the boys and Blade Runner and Judge Dredd and uh, Trailer Park Boys. They've even got a comic book now. Awesome. Old Bubbles has got a comic book. And of course we have Mr. Pool right there's here. There's Mr. Pool. He's here to oh, take pictures oh. with the kids and the adults and try to be as inappropriate as possible, I'm sure. Not only comic books good for you to read, but when you have too many chimichangas, it's good to- toilet paper. <laughs> <laughs> now Deadpool. I'm pretty sure Deadpool. there are kids watching this. You have toilet chimichangas. <laughs> <laughs> no, we are. I listen at him. Yeah, I know they are. He doesn't care. Hey, that's what usually comes out of his mouth. Of course. <laughs> Definitely don't want that. No. Mm. For those of you who do not know, Deadpool is actually the first movie that me and my wife went on a date to see. Well, so, <laughs> well, thank you for giving your contribution to this lovely face of mine. Because underneath this, I look like a. My parents look like avocados had sex with an uglier avocado. We have the uh, Deadpool Black, White, and Blood, number one. Mm-hmm. And you are a Deadpool fan. That's right. I'm very, not a Deadpool fan. I'm a Spider-Man fan. That's right. He likes Spider-Man. Yeah, I'm Spider-Man. And Wolverine. Don't forget Wolverine. Oh, of course. Everybody knows he loves Wolverine. I think Wolverine is a little jealous because my spikes are a little sharper and a little longer. Oh. Oh. Spot words. <laughs> Shots fired. Let you we, hear both, we both regenerate, so it'll be an ongoing fight forever. Exactly. <laughs> and I can fight with him always. <laughs> well now. Hey oh! Hey <laughs> Put a little bit of gobo more in there. Hey oh! Devon Haley has been eliminated. Ollie Primo has been eliminated. Dirty Joe has been eliminated. Carolina Kid has been eliminated. Joseph Everhart has been eliminated. Down to the last of the Mohican. So anyway, guys, hope you all enjoyed my interview with Sean, as well as the little wrestling uh, clip that I threw in there from the uh, show this past weekend. Got some goodies to show you. Got uh, the Batman you've seen in the uh, interview. Uh, Got some King Shark. Uh, Stray Dogs. The one uh, Sean was telling me that was like uh, Silence of the Lambs meets All Dogs Go to Heaven, so... Sounds like something my warped mind would enjoy. So, uh, uh, enter the house of the slaughter. Got some Zorro. So, yeah, um, and my wife, uh, found this one for me. This, uh, Vampire the Masquerade. So, uh, yeah. She found, uh, some goodies. I found some goodies. Uh, 
found a Archie comic that I gave to my wife. Uh, but uh, I hope you all enjoyed the video. If you did, give me a like, share, subscribe, leave a comment down below. And as always, take care and have a blessed day.